Our universe is singing her beautiful song that infers the unexpected beauty of her story to us, a song that we had been so far been missing with telescopes or electromagnetic waves, and that space-time song is being provided by one of the most mind-blowing scientific discoveries called gravitational waves. The existence of gravitational waves leads to another beginning of a new era in astrophysics. The wave of gravity. Well, what is gravity? Imagine our space-time looks like this. Gravity is a consequence of curvature in space-time, but what determines this curvature? Well, the sources that can curve space-time can be the mass or energy of matters. The geometry of space-time is curvature, which can be described using mathematical tools such as the metric tensor, the Riemann tensor, the Ricci tensor, and the Ricci scalar. And the energy and mass of the matters along with their motion in our universe can be described using a single tool, which is known as stress energy momentum tensor. And both curvature tensor and stress energy momentum tensor must obey Einstein gravitational field equations, which was written as an equality between the curvature in spacetime and the matters that attribute to this curvature. In simple term, matters curve spacetimes and spacetime tell matters how to move. In the past, the theory of gravitational waves was only proof on paper, not until 14 September 2015 that it was no longer a science fiction when the very first gravitational wave generated by the collision of two black holes 1.3 billion light years ago was detected by the most extremely precise and sensitive interferometer, COLIGO, in both Louisiana and Washington state. It stretched space-time in one dimension and compressed it in another. But why did I tell you that we can hear the space-time song? Well, now listen to this. And any accelerated masses in our universe create these gravitational waves. I can create gravitational waves. Not only you, I can create gravitational waves too. The most interesting sources of gravitational waves are binary systems, high-energy astronomical phenomena like collision of black holes, neutron stars, and supernovae propagate these cosmic ripples. Although the sources that generate them undergo tremendously violent events, the strongest gravitational waves have a really minute effect on Earth since the sources of them are mostly in a great distance. But why is this important? Some cosmic events are surrounded by thick layers or do not emit electromagnetic radiation, so the only way to study those regions in our universe is via gravitational waves being converted into sound. It unveils what occurs at the moment of Big Bang, describes the phenomena around binaries, especially opens up a new window to cosmological observation. Quantum mechanics and general relativity are really incompatible, so there is an attempt to unify both of them with something called quantum gravity. They say a particle called graviton, which is not yet proven to exist, made up gravitational waves. And this might be a mystery, as a grand unification waiting to be found in physics.